Someone's barred the door and chained the sunken star. There's undead here. We haven't fought undead in a while. No reaching these. They're mindless. I thought you could control them. I'm afraid sometimes the dead work themselves into frenzies. Poor things. <laughs> I must free that bell. Need some help? Thank you. The star, the bell, can banish these despair spirits if we unchain it. We'll need a wisp to unseal the doors leading out. Could you please find one and bring it here? Okay. How? Give your greetings and the wisp will follow. Hello. Ah, wisps are the simplest of spirits, but quite helpful. Bring the wisp here and we can unseal the doors. Doors open. Where to now? This should lead us to the upper chambers, where we can free the bell. There's someone I'd like to consult with on the way. So, Professor. Just Emery, please. You weren't that surprised we need a Fade expert. The spirits talk. Even the simplest have been clamoring about chaos in the Fade. Someone coming to consult wasn't an much as a win. Freezing. What kind of magic is this? Echoes of the despair spirits. Misery devouring itself. We should keep our distance. If provoked, these manifestations will shatter. This is lot two. Didn't see any wisps around. Then I shall call for aid.
They've answered. We'll need to guide the wisps who've just arrived to the door. Wisps really came just because you asked. They care for us, Rook. Strange. This door shouldn't be here. Shouldn't it? The necropolis rearranges itself every so often. our second wisp. Just waiting for us. Almost polite. I assure you, good warden, not everything in the necropolis is as hostile as despair. Take your word for it. the last wisp. Good. Let's return to the door. Well done. Past these chambers, we'll find some assistance with reaching the bell. Despair is far more pervasive than I thought. We must stop who's ever drawing these spirits here, Rook. You think a person's behind all the despair demons? Oh, yes. Mortals are their prime attraction. Better be ready. Keep that up. 
How do we get rid of all these despair demons? Their source is near the bell you saw earlier. Ringing it will banish them, but we must find who lured them there in the first place. Tell me, Rook, where are you from? I trained with the Wardens in the Anderfels. Home to the Fortress of Weishaupt. I've heard stories. You must tell me about your journeys once we're above ground. Ah, here we are. This is where we'll learn who summoned these despair spirits. But how? You must open yourself to possibilities while in the Necropolis. Would you mind lighting those brassiers, Rook? This should unseal our final pass to the bell. It's best we unchain it quickly. What's this magic bell do exactly? The sunken star will drive away despair. Any malicious spirit that hears the tolling of the bell will be banished to the fane. Ring the bell, dead demons. Got it. It also holds great significance on some of our equinoctial rituals. You already sold me. the body and we'll begin. By seal and flame, who brought despair in our midst? Despair? Who brought it here? Venatori. The Venatori. Uh, of course. This way, please. What did you just do? The colloquial term is corpse whispering, a gift that manifested with my magic. Gift is one word for it. Honestly, I've no idea how the other Watchers navigate the Necropolis without it. Useless. We wasted three slaves in those traps. If that hand of glory burns down, so we found those Venatori. They have no place in these halls. Let's go! 
What are the Venatori after? Gold? Artifacts? Raw magic. Their first endpoints were obsessed with gathering power for some new masters. Ah, I'll fill you in on them later. Bear demon? <sighs> That's the last of them. I see someone by the crates. I don't think they're Venatori. This looks interesting. A spirit labyrinth? I didn't know they'd learn to make miniature ones into Vinter. Hello. The Venatori bring you here. They said... They said I'd spilled the wine too many times. That I'd be a better sacrifice than slave. You are in Navarra, sir. There are no slaves on our soil. Please remain here. After we've seen to the rest of the Venatori, I'll send for someone to escort you above. Oh, all, all right. Those Venatori dragged that man down here just to die. The Watchers will shelter him. We'll inquire if he has any family in Minrathus. As for the Venatori, what remains of them will be put to work.
The sunken star can help us if we break the Venatori's chains. Right. Chain. We must return to the lower level to ring the bell. Be ready. The ritual to wake the bell will draw despair's attention. And any more Venatori? I'll need you to keep them occupied while I work. the Venatori. How do they defy us? How are we doing, Emery? The bell is slowly Fight a little longer.
Impressive. Thank you. But come, let's ensure these cultists didn't leave anything dangerous behind. I'll ask our attendants to gather their bodies later, of course. And this is a severed hand. Can't be. A hand of glory? The Venatori should never have this. I must find out where it came from. Let me know when you'd like to return to the chambers above. Let's get back to the lighthouse. You can tell me why you've sought out a Fade expert on the way? I know it's a lot, but I swear we've seen the Blighted Elven Gods ourselves. It would explain recent Oniric disruptions. At the least, the implications of what Rooks witnessed are... Ah, thank you, Manfred. Well, hi. And... thanks? <laughs> You spoke of danger to the Fade. The Elven Gods plan to tear it wide open to get to the Blight. And they've already messed with it. Demons. Tears in reality. Our team needs a Fade expert. Many Watchers never depart Navarra. But with events so dire... I... I'd be delighted to assist. It has been many years since you left us. Well, yes, but Elven Gods... Ancient magics. I couldn't bear miss this. Besides, I've spent my life exploring the Fade and speaking to spirits. If Rook needs an expert, none are better qualified than I. You're good in a fight. We went through a lot of demons. I've faced worse in the Necropolis. Welcome aboard. Wonderful! I'll gather my things. Come, Manfred. The Grand Necropolis was at peace again, and Emmerich was off to a new adventure. But in Navarra, nothing stays down for long. The Venatori had unearthed something no one should have, and delivered it to the worst possible person. Emmerich's journey 
would soon bring him face to face with the gloaming lantern. <laughs> What the Venatori ultimately intended with their incursions into the necropolis worries me. Whether or not it was directed by the gods, the timing serves them well. Chaos, I fear, is their ally. With this, Demeta's crossing and the Blighted Dragons, and everything else we're all dealing with, feels like we're at war. A lot of little wars. Didn't take the gods long to attract support from all the worst people in Thedas. They're offering power to anyone who wants it. The Venatori and Antum won't question what it will cost. So how do we fight back then? We don't have an army, but we do have allies. Like the Veil Jumpers. After Demeter's crossing, it's personal for them. The Crows, particularly after we helped save their city. They and Viago know what is owed. They will make good on that debt. Also, Lady Morrigan requested a meeting at the Cobbled Swan in Minrathis. Could she have found some trace of the gods? Probably. Morrigan doesn't visit crowded taverns for fun. I also heard from Grey Wardens out in the Hosburg wetlands, Antoine and Evka. Something strange is happening with the Blight there. I bet it involves the gods. Gilanane has laid low since we hurt her dragon, but the Blight spreads rot wherever the gods go. And no one's better at tracking Blight than Wardens. Morrigan and those Wardens feel like our best leads on finding the gods. Are they really gods? Or just ancient mages? It's not clear. They're gods. Or oh, the closest damn thing to them. Nev, you're back. Yeah, I am. Good to have you back. This is Professor Emmerich Volkarin, our Fade expert, and Tash, our dragon hunter. They joined while you were away. Hey. Charmed. Right. Not everyone has met. So you're a dragon hunter? Mirathus could have used you. What's going on? Back home. What isn't? Look, you made an impossible call without enough information. I get it. It's the corner the gods put us in. It just... might take time to shake off. You are back though, right? Yeah, Belle. I'm back. Good to have you back. Whatever the circumstances. Everyone needs to be part of this. That's the only way we'll win. After what happened to Minrathus, I've got even more reason to go after the gods. If anyone's got a shot at this, it's the people here. I'm still on the job. Count on it. Great. Let's follow up on some leads. I'll let Lady Morrigan know we're ready to meet. I'll send word to Antoine and Evka. They're holed up in a town called Lavendel. Everyone else should rest up. Be ready to move when I call. Never easy, is it, kid? What do you mean? Making the big choices, then living with the consequences. Feels like stopping two gods isn't the kind of thing that should get handed to a fresh leader. 
Though, someone needs to be in charge, right? Everyone's looking to me for answers. I have to be ready to give them, even when I'm not certain. And that's why I recruited you, Rook. I knew you could fill my shoes. Anyway, you've got a meeting with Morrigan to attend, and dealing with whatever the Wardens found. All this chatting has taken it out of me. Think I'll rest for a bit. Good work, Rook. You'll find your way through this. I know it. Look who's thoughtful. The spirits lament, Dweller. The blight spreads here. Seek its roots.
and knowledge. Rook, welcome to the Hosberg Wetlands. I'd say make yourself comfortable. I could sense blight before we were through the Alluvian. What's happening? That's the question, isn't it? Oh, one of them. The blight's always a problem in the Anderfels. It's not strange to find a corrupted patch of forest or swamp. What is strange is the sudden surge of blight through the Hosberg Wetlands. Much like the village you found, the blight here struck too quickly and in strange forms. It's choked the whole area, and the local village, Lavendel, was caught in it. But they're survivors. We can be grateful for that. If there was a place that needed wardens... Then here we are. As far as we can tell, the gods you're chasing weren't here directly. If the Blight's really changed, then the changes are widespread. As for how much... I... I can almost sense something in there. Another sound under the Blight's usual song. Sensing the Blight is one thing. What you're saying is... concerning. When we met, you tried to block the sound out. Now you hear too much. If it helps, that's what we're here for. Should I be worried? About me? No. About the Blight? Yes. But you already are. We heard rumors of the Surge here and volunteered to investigate. The First Warden expects a report. Soon. If we want proof the Blight's changed, then this place is where to find it. 
But the way the Blight left the village, we've had our hands full just keeping it back and helping the sick. You need more to study. Yes. The odd growths the Blight has formed, like boyars, they surround Lavendel. I need more samples. It's a good thing another Warden showed up. Even if it's you. You collapse a building to seal off Darkspawn one time. And get us all in trouble. <laughs> Worth it. You know we like you, so be careful out there. I will. I'll be back as soon as I can. Hello there. Good day. All right, let's find those boiled samples. Looks like there's ca- You've been to the farmlands? There's a family, Vos. I'm close with him, with Ursa. They spoke of the blight. The blight, before all of this, happened. They knew. But if they knew, why aren't they here? If I find anything, I'll let you know. <sighs> Lavendel Village. Whatever happened here looks like the Meta's crossing. And yet, life remains. There. That's our blight boil. Got a sample. Guessing they'll need more than one. Both samples improve the accuracy of any study. Unpleasant though the gathering process may be. Fine. Example.
This will open the way. Got it. If the gods spread blight, imagine the entire world remade like these infested wetlands. Ha! 